Hey, what's up everybody? It's me, Silly Supreme, and welcome to something new on the channel. Today we are going to be playing 1979 Revolution. Uh, apparently, if, as far as I know, this game takes place during the 1979 Iranian Revolution. And I decided, you know, this has been sitting in my library for a minute. So, might as well hop in, right? And they did tout this game when I was booing it up, saying that this is a headphones experience. So, who knows what that means. But anyway, let's hop in. Play. Start chapter one. All right. Let's see where this is going to go. We're going to deal with some shenanigans. I think we might deal with some shenanigans. In the summer of 1978, thousands of Iranians flooded the streets and fought for a change. Despite their class, religious beliefs, and political allegiance, the protests erupted into a bloody uprising against Iran's self-appointed king, the Shah. What are you... Wait, what you are about to experience is based off of real stories about people. Choices you will make will shape your experience in this revolution. Ooh. Okay. Let me drink my monster. We're in Tehran. <clears throat> if you're listening to this, then it means you received my package. Unfortunately, this will be my last drop, as I've been forced into hiding. With the U.S. hostage situation, it's become unsafe to get anything out of Iran. You must get these to the press immediately. Many people's lives depend on it, including my own. If anything should happen to me, you must trust Bibi. I'm worried that our darkest days are still ahead of us. I have no idea what I just did. Remember what I said when I first joined the revolution? Peace is the best weapon. Violence justifies the means. Not worth the sacrifice. Freedom or death? That it's better to die fighting for freedom than to live a prisoner. They found us. Baby, what's going on? Quick, grab the plans. We need to go now. Okay. Okay, where is it? Find the plans before the time runs out. Oh god. Alright. Uh President, what are you doing? Kamini revised. The shot left. Find it. Find it. Uh, uh, I will. Open the door. Hurry, oh, Reza. That's the plan? Quickly, Reza. Uh, no, that's not the plan. Uh, right there. Okay, I right got it. it. Okay. <laughs> you know what to do, Reza John. Okay, okay. Is happening. Free! Uh, uh, oh God! You want hey, some of this? Come on! Uh, 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 Feel the icon by clicking on it repeatedly before the time runs out. Okay. That's enough. Oh great. Uh, oh shit! Just got real all of a sudden. Yep. Ink Stories presents. Iran, because of the great leadership. That's the shot. Is an island of stability in one of the most developed areas of the world. Dun, dun. Rather not even remember. Well, so the tells me shit's gonna get real right like here. <laughs> Honestly, the whole like story behind this game is gonna be the most interesting part. Actually, I think this is like really only game I can think of where it's gonna talk about the Armenian Revolution. Cool guys don't look at explosions. <laughs> in Iran has escalated sharply in recent months. The main targets have been... But I'm really interested to see how the choices will affect the whole outcome of the revolution. Yeah, I wonder what shenanigans, like, will probably screw it up. But yeah, like, like this whole intro showed that Iran was, like, kind of like a Western nation before, like, the... Ooh. 
I almost spilled my drink. <laughs> Yep. I'm in prison for April 3rd, 1980. Yep. We've been tortured. You're a very lucky man, Mr. Shirazi. In Am my I? former life, I wouldn't have let you live. Drink. You must be thirsty. Reza, your chai is getting cold. Drink the tea. Let's play it nice, play cool. Good. He won't forget this. Oh God. Telltale Games is striking him. This could be a very unpleasant place. I don't think you guys can see it, but at the bottom right, because the achievement progress thing keeps popping up. We are correcting paths. Correcting paths? Is that what you call this? Ah! You will learn not to disrespect me. <clears throat> Oh, he ain't playing. That scar tells me he's a badass. You were one of us. We fought side by side to overthrow the Shah. <laughs> that Western puppet. What changed? Your government is just as corrupt. When did you lose your faith? Instead of helping the new regime, you masterminded horrendous acts of violence against us. So we're a Are you ready for your redemption? I can save you, Rizzo. Be badass. Go to hell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hell is what I'm trying to save you from, Rizzo. Open open it. it. Go on, open it. Or are you afraid to confront your past? Nah, we ain't afraid. Let's do this. Open it. Your photos rallied our nation to rebel against the Shah. But now, they are being used to identify those who plot against our new Islamic government. Good offering. Show me an act of good faith, and I will be fair. Oh, people are being tortured in the background. Reza Shirazi, you are charged with treason and conspiring to carry out a series of attacks against the Islamic Republic of Iran. How do you plead? Does it really matter how I plead? Do you know what we do to traitors here in Evan prison? Stay silent. <laughs> <All right. laughs> <We>. uh, <laughs> but you must think of me. I know so much about you, Reza John. I know that you are coming from a very well connected family who are loyal to the Shah. And I know about your Savak brother Hussein. Leave my brother out of this. I know that upon your return from Germany, you joined our fight against the Shah, despite your family's wishes. But what do you know about me? Do you know who I am? Who are you? <laughs> you are the interrogator. I see. My name is Asadullah Lajavardi. But you already knew that. Now that's his name. Didn't you? you just unlocked him apparently. No. I guess in the gallery. What is my name? Asshole Lajavardi. Ah! Oh, <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I knew this was <laughs> Why can't you show me the decency of remembering my name? Say my name. My name is Asadullah Lajavardi. We're not doing this, Walter. But here in Evan, I am they not. call me Hajar. 
Uh. Now, what is my name? No. Let's just get this over with. What is my name? <coughs> okay. Uh, that's all you got? Speak off! Harpazan! Ray saying. This is your last chance, Reza. You. Uh, uh, oh god, did I die? What? Uh, <laughs> that killed me? Oh, come on. That, that was just a kick. Aww. Why can't you show me the decency of remembering my name? Well, looks like we're back to here. My name is Asadullah. Lord I'm Javadi. just gonna refuse once then. But here I still show dominance <laughs> on the ground. They call me Hajar. <laughs> yeah, that go on. Now, what is my name? I say nothing. Let's just get this over with. What is my name? <laughs> I'ma refuse again. <laughs> That's all you got? Speak off! Harpazan! Bye. Hajj! Hajj Aga! Hajj Aga. See? That wasn't so difficult. Yeah, I didn't want you to kick me to death. Get out. Get out! Intensely flame motions. Excuse me? Reza. Is that a pipe? The three men arrested with you have been executed. They confessed. They told us everything. We found your plans to bomb the Revolutionary Guards headquarters. Just reference for the I don't know of any plans. Look, <laughs> I'm just a photographer. Do you know what this is? Is that a cattle prod, actually? Of course you don't. A city boy like you. Yep, this is a cattle prod. Oh, God. He's never had a use <laughs> for a cattle prod. Until now. It takes about 400 milliamps to stop a human heart. We don't want that. Not yet, anyway. But 25 milliamps? That burns you from the inside. Oh, God. It could damage an organ if I'm not careful. He's just gonna torture us. But you have been such a good guest. This might not be necessary. Yeah, I drank your tea. Hear voice or the machine. Give us all the information about your collaborators and the details of your next target. Hello. Let's start with your friend, Bobak Ozan. When's the flashback gonna start? Who is he? Where can we find him? Is he the one who recruited you? Was he? The mastermind behind the attacks in March. What attack? Oh, 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 here comes a flashback. Da -da -da. Well, see, so now I gotta be careful of being killed in here. <laughs> it even seemed like it would have killed me. Chapter three. Disco, here you are, Bob Akjan. Yeah, he just kicked me like three times in the ribs. Yeah. Was it? Rizzo, what are you doing? Chikar Mikoni. I know I'm good looking, but save your film for something important. Come on, yeah. This is history in the making, Bobak. Now, Bobo, now you're about to see history in the making. But I have plans for this picture back in Germany. Oh, yeah? That's nice of you, Reza John. Oh, not for me, it's for Hanau. 
Hanna? Hanna kia? Oh, you're gonna like her. She's got a thing for you, Ronnie. Oh, yeah, well, Ron. <laughs> yeah, man. I've told her about you and your legendary Has anyone Disco seen that movie? Uh, what was it? Don't you hold the ball? has nothing on me. <laughs> nice. Uh, Here. First, they killed hey, my shit. father. It kind of is giving me the vibe, the similar Bush. vibes of that movie. It's Khomeini's but latest speech, and it just part. came from France. A new Iran is coming, Reza John, and I'm here to help spread the word. Dang, they don't really give you time. What do you to mean a new Iran? Iran? Yes, a new Iran. For everyone, not just for a few. Babak, what are you so worried about? They have eyes everywhere. And these cassettes have become the voice of the revolution and therefore a threat to the regime. Now take it, Boba. Yeah. You know you want to. All right, take it. Let's take it. Okay, I'll take it. Trust me. Speech You're not going to regret one. it. You think what's on this could really make a difference? Come on, Reza. Let's change Iran. I'm here to take pictures, not choose sides. Yeah, we Everyone don't know yet. We're not a revolutionary okay? just yet. Everyone. It's just words, Bobak. Maybe to you, it's just words. But to me, it's words that have never been spoken out loud before. The time is now, Reza John. To you know me, Fami, you know this. That's why you're here. Russian. Okay, I'll give it a listen. I mean, that's all I ask. Bye -bye. Okay? This. But keep it hidden. And whatever you do, do not listen to it at home. I don't even want to imagine what your mother would do. <laughs> yeah. You're still scared of my mother, huh? <laughs> and you're not? Good point. <laughs> okay, Baba, Bia, let's get a better view. BB wants you to capture how big this is becoming. Who's BB? You're gonna like her. This is all because of her. Whoa. See why I told you to save your film? This is incredible. Really? This is the future of Iran. This is our future. Start taking pictures. Hey, can you read what that says, Reza? Some people call them martyrs, but to me, they were victims. So, so me. There's a slider and a focus range, and then, oh, you gotta wait till it. There we are. Dying a martyr was an act of heroism and a common theme on the banners of the revolution. Learn more. Look at that. Got this little, um, uh, page up here with more info. Protesters held portraits of martyred men, sometimes women, praising their noble sacrifice. Long live the martyrs of the Islamic revolution. Martyrdom is something of great meaning across many cultures and religion. So Muslims respect Imam Hussein just as Christians hail St. Stephen, both of whom died for their cause. The value of religious self-sacrifice combined with the physical defenselessness against the Shah's well-armed military made martyrdom a common theme on the banners of the revolution. Ooh. Speech I have repeatedly said oh. that neither my desire, nor my age, nor my position allows me to govern. I don't want to have the power or the government in my hand. I am not interested in personal power. It is the Iranian people who have selected their own capable and trustworthy individuals and give them the responsibilities. However, personally, I can't accept any special role or responsibility. After the Shah's departure from Iran, I will not become a president nor accept any other leadership role. Just like before, I limit my activities only to guiding and directing the people. So all of these from Ayatollah Khomeini. I never thought I'd see the day the Shah statue would be trashed. The King statue. The revolution successfully abolished Iran's 2,500-year-old monarchy, reshaping the course of the nation's history. Ooh, let's learn more about this real quick. I'm not going to check for all of these, but I'll check for some of them. The Pahlavi Pahl 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 dynasty of Iran, Muhammad Reza Shah and his father Reza Shah reigned for over 50 years. Their combined reign was just a blip on the timeline of Iran's 2,500-year-old history of continuous monarchy. The abolition of the Iranian monarchy marked a tremendous turning point for the people in the politics of Iran. Looks like Khomeini, right? It's Shariat Madori, Grand Ayatollah. I've never seen anything like this. There has to be at least 100,000 people on the I'm streets. I'm not even going to begin to pronounce that. This religious leader with outspoken progressive beliefs. Over here. For miles, the universal hope for change and passion people from all backgrounds to join the revolution. 
Early September 1978, half a million protesters marched through Tehran. Hey, good luck trying to buy anything from the bazaar. All the shopkeepers have gone on strike too. When the Shah threatened martial law, reported 30,000 oil workers went on strike, causing a crippling chain reaction. Ooh, actually, I want to see about this. Growing arrest among the working class brought bustling cities to a standstill. When the Shah threatened martial law, reported 30,000 oil workers went on strike. The strike caused a chain reaction as employees of schools, factories, banks, and other government institutions followed suit. This act of resistance played an instrumental role in the collapse of the Shah's regime. To some, those praying? people praying oh, yeah. would be intimidating, but to me, it's pretty powerful. Mass public prayers were the sit-ins of the Iranian Revolution. Well, Mike, seriously, I can't wait this to get these developed. Did you get a picture of Ayatollah Shariat Madori? People are saying that he should lead Iran. Yeah, I think I did. He's a cleric who understands the hearts of the oppressed. Yeah. No religious mullah is going to lead this country. Fahmidi, understand? That's over. Why not? Are we not a nation of Muslims, brother? Brother, Barodar, we are a nation of equality greater than Western capitalism or your paganism. Bifamidi, understand? The hell? No mullah will run this government. Yo. Bifami, Jimmy hey, comrade. Lighten up. Chufti, you better back hey, away hey, from hey, the wait, okay? Are these communists? We don't do this, all them. right? This, all of this is about non-violence. Yeah. We don't want to give the army any reason to intervene. I don't trust yeah. this punk with his camera. Hey, Keep walking. That's right. He's communist. Yeah, I get it. I figured they were communists when he said Western capitalism. Man, Bobak, what happened to you back there? Look, just because I didn't kick his ass doesn't mean I didn't want to. Yeah. Did you see that? You guys share the same barber? Swine. That's all you got. Come on, let's hit the streets. Yeah. Leave the communists up on the roof. Not the Iran you left. Charizard Avenue. Well, there's Uncle Sam. There's the shot. It's not the Iran you left a year ago. The people are angry, especially after Savak burned down the cinema wrecks. Yeah. Are you talking about the fire? Don't tell me you haven't heard of cinema wrecks. Over 400 people died in that fire. And now it's time for answers. You think it can get out of control? Look, it could get ugly, but we won't achieve anything through violence. Army How are the people going to take on an army? Look, Reza John, you have to believe in the power of people, okay? Good will triumph. Now come on, it's time to discover what this revolution's all about. Maybe we could do it, like, try to be peaceful. Alright, let's discover what this revolution's all about. What in the hell is this man wearing? That's an interesting look. I've seen this guy before. He calls himself the Walking Dead. He's a walking memorial. Pesaram, my son, dead. please take a picture. Show the world what is happening here. Well, sure thing. I don't want to take a picture of this guy behind okay, you. Okay, Reza, just look at this street as a sandwich. <laughs> Are you okay, oh. Bobby? Yeah, I'm great. Oh, Liam, it's the perfect analogy oh, yeah, with the perfect ingredients. The bread, the cheese, the sea dunet. Oh, I thought they were gonna actually show a picture of someone like doing that actually. Sabzi and the tea. Saman won't forget this. Look at all these. I guess they're feeling all these people. Approaching, you know, click on hotspots. I bet you don't see too many Pecons in Germany. Set it ablaze. The Iranian chariot. Leaving the patrons unable to escape the building. Anything going on over here? I mean, I could take more photos. Think about it, Reza. The laborers, the bazaaris, they're the bread, the noon. You can't make a lochman without barbari, and you definitely can't have a functioning society without workers. Okay, I'm listening. Ooh. Ugh. Honestly, the, the one thing I will say about this game so far is that the camera here. Wait, how do you this? Oh, yeah, 
Yeah, I, oh, there's more photos. I hear someone trapping out right now. But Allah pay for it by the Islamic Republican Party. This uh, of the revolution was suspected of having ties to Hezbollah, an arguably reactionary religious party with militant tendency. Any more photo opportunities? Oh, 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 okay. Can I get out of this? Oh, okay, there we go. Ever seen another cinema in Shiraz? I don't see too many pecans in German. In a restaurant injured one person. A week before that, uh. three people were killed at a cinema in Shard. <laughs> the Iranian government <laughs> says that the death toll really of the right. cinema wreck in Abadan has officially reached 400. Radio Iran reports that the bodies of 377 people were recovered from the rubble. Uh, As I was saying, Reza, the cheese, the paneer, that's what makes a sandwich a sandwich. In the cars we drive, the clothes we wear, the things we follow, that's what makes Iran Hush, boy, one of I'm the biggest exporters of oil in the world. And our people still have to stand in line to fill up their tanks. Tell me that isn't backwards. The oil strikes of late 1978 brought a sudden halt in oil production leading to widespread shortage. Anyways, that's what makes <laughs> Anyways. Iran Iran. Oh, there's one right here. So is it peace you want or a fight? Peace and security. Iran is our country. I guess this is anti-Western. This is violent, and I was just seeing peace. It might not be as poetic as Hoffa's or Rumi, but it gets the message across. Think about putting your slogan on the wall of martyr. Okay. Anyways, mint, basil, tarragon. The students, writers, the revolutionaries, giving us the extra kick we need to set change in motion. My father and my brother are okay. rotting in jail. Too much How many more, more must unjustly be imprisoned so that the Shah can live in his lavish palace and deny us our basic freedoms? Here, brother, read the truth of what is really happening. Anything else you read is corrupt and filled with lies. Sure, I'll take a pamphlet. Thank you, sister. Stay true, brother. It's the only legitimate source to read now. What was that? What? Really going on in our what? country? That's the second speech. What? I. <laughs> yeah, okay. The Bush of Evan, based on a real person, a scorned prisoner of the Shah's regime, and member of the Islamic fundamentalist group. Uh, that Islam, Asadola acted as Evans prison warden in the early 1980s. Over 7,900 political prisoners were tortured and executed in his four years of wardenship, 2,500 of which he was personally responsible for. Took pride in his handling of inmates. He brought his family to live on Evans' premises and called the prison a converted university or ideological school where prisoners study Islam and learn their errors. He was later removed from his position after complaints by other Islamic officials of his unusually harsh and excessive torture. Of I have repeatedly said. What's the second? Can I get the second audio tape? The foundation of okay. our Islamic government is based on freedom of dialogue and will fight against any kind of censorship. In the Islamic Republic, the rights of the religious minorities are respectfully regarded. Our future society will be a free society and all the elements of oppression, cruelty and force will be destroyed. We would like to run the Islamic government like Islam at its beginning, so that people know how different the Islamic democracy is from other democracies. If the people of the world know the benefits of Islam, my hope is that they all become Muslims. Interesting. Let's get to you all from here. Also, I don't even know when this game saves. I don't think there is like a save 
uh, point in here. Oh, I can. Oh, wait, there, there's an interactive over there. I can take a picture right here. Barbari is na is a Rand's national flag break. It is common to find a. I do not know what that says. Or bread break leaf on every street corner. Yo, can I get some? Baba, I can smell the barbari. There's nothing else like it. Enjoy this, my friend. Nusha Junit. Looks like and pizza without uh the toppings. Oh God, brother. I'm inside of you. Uh everyone has the right and the government I, I hear you there. <laughs> So far, this game isn't bad. Like I'm right, you see, Anyways, like in the story, the but it's the kind of like on top has like a, all the people like left a slight in the layer of janky shop. to it. The drug addicts, the beggars, the poor. Very dangerous. Let's take a picture of her. While some enjoyed a time of great prosperity during the Shah's rule, poverty and inequality became a rapidly growing problem. Can we be nice? The rich get richer and the poor get poorer. There's no chance for people like her in Iran her today. Her hand is Let more... The, smoke of this the baby has more detail than her hand. Inshallah. Merci, Khanum. I hope you and your child find what you need. Esfandu, esfandu. Esfandu. Ooh, we're definitely going to be able to take a picture over here. People use the walls to post information and writing, too. At least before it gets torn down. Hey, brother. Got something to post to the wall? Khub negokun. Un barodarame. That's my brother. He died for this revolution. Post something. Let the people know they're not alone. Post the slogan. Yeah, there. Peace and security. Can I take a picture of this? Okay, I posted that on the wall. Hopefully that'll lead to something good down the line. It's a newsstand. He's a real rock star. Yeah, yeah, Kush is good, but Darius is the man. Pick magazine. That John Travolta? It, I, it's, <laughs> Pick magazine. All right, oh. Bye bye. Gugush released a new album. Damn Pop scam. music. I love Gugush. Gugush is beautiful. What about the other mags? Can I check those out? Modernization. What about here? See that stack of prayer cards? The guy who owns the stand is probably Christian. Hey, if Gugush and Adidas are good cheese, this guy getting mistreated because of his beliefs, that would be bad cheese. You're crazy, Bobak. That would be bad cheese. cheese. Any more? I see these, these, these. I don't think there's any more than that. Uh, yeah, 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 you know what? Hang on. Before I figure out when to uh, wrap this up, I kind of want to see that. Oh, here. Oh, this is a catalog of all of this. What about those are all the? Oh, this is like the photo book. Foundation what would of it be Islamic for, government. huh? I they would have it. Um, talk about the modernization, religious leader, Barbary, the it girl. Oh, here it is. The Iranian popular music scene of the 1970s was dominated by one name, Gugush. That is a that's actually a picture. <laughs> Gugush, 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 Gugush. I like it, Gugush. Her talent and stage presence led to a massive success as a singer, actress, performer, and fashion icon. As a jill of all trades, she often collaborated with other Iranian pop icons like musician uh, Dariush Iqbali and actor Baruz Fazughi, who she was married to briefly. Gugush's influence on Iran's cultural narrative ran deeper than superficial contributions. Iran's youth looked to her as a trendsetter in beauty and fashion. However, it was her captivating voice and haunting ballads that came to define the thrills and heartbreaks of a generation in a tumultuous chapter in Iranian history. 
The new Islamic regime outlawed popular music, ending Gagush's career in Iran. She continued to make music in the U.S. but ran, remained in Tehran until 2000. Let's see. With modernization sweeping the nation, Iranian men and women pursued Western interests in non-traditional music, fashion, trends, and lifestyles. Parenting magazines like Mom offered tips on how to enrich one's child with comics, short stories, and a number of games. The magazines also ushered in a different era of parenting that involved self-reflection with a greater focus on the child's desires and aspirations, a modern concept for a traditional society. Hmm. They also represent, yeah, the Zoroastrians. Oh, cool. So let's see. Iran is home to the largest population of Shia Muslims in the world, but it is also home to a variety of religious minorities who shared rich paths for thousands of years. There are over 70 non Muslim places of worship in Tehran alone, including many churches, synagogues, Zoroastrian fire temples, and Sheikh Gudwars. Yet one faith in particular has endured a long history of discrimination and persecution in Iran, both pre and post revolution. Members of the Baha'i faith, a monotheistic religion that teaches one of the spirituality and oneness of humanity, are not formally recognized in Iran's 1906 constitution. Baha'is live in the shadows and face institutional social prejudice. Take a lesson. Ooh, another cassette tape. You see, Take I'm not the only one with these cassettes. Man, they had to turn this photo thing into a weird, like, mini game. The most widespread and successful yeah, yeah. undertaking yeah, form of revolutionary communication through circulation audio tapes. Did I get one? I have something special for you. Look at all these cassettes. I have lots of Khomeini and even Shariat Nadari. Yeah, Bushkon, how did you get Rock music. What? Yeah. Yeah. Strut down the street. Let's get to the front before the crowd pushes us back. Oh, man. Right, cool. Let's do it. This is going to be great, photos. Reza. One day we can tell our kids about this. No matter what, Paul, keep your eyes on me and let's not lose each other in the crowd. All right. I think, was that the end of the chapter? Is it? Okay. Are you okay? Brothers and sisters, forget what you have right, read in the newspapers. Five. They are okay. filled with the Shah's lies. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna assume it's saved right there at chapter five. If not, I can hop back in. But I'm gonna wrap this video up right here. So far, this story is good enough to be somewhat interesting. A little bit of jank, but uh, I'm partial to that because this is so far more on the story than it is on the graphic side of things like the gameplay isn't terrible so far like um the one thing i wish it did change was like the camera thing because i wish it was just take a photo uh of something instead of like waiting for it to go on focus because uh it's a little bit kind of breaks the pacing a bit but overall so far the story is very interesting so looking at the iranian revolution through reza's eyes and the fact that we can also affect, you know, the characters and maybe like the outcome of certain characters' stories uh, with our actions, really something that'll keep your attention. Plus, I kind of like it how they also have like little tidbits of information about the revolution instead, like giving general overviews of like, you know, people, the background, like, you know, how Iran was before, during, and after the revolution. So I really want to see where this goes. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you would like to see more. And I hope to see you guys again the next time. This is Solo Supreme and have a great day, folks. Now this one is pure niceness.